got one thing on my mind. After being screwed over by everybody in the World Wrestling Federation, after being by, abandoned by all you good fans right here in the United States of America, I decide that I'm gonna go into this submission match with Stone Cold Steve Austin and give him just a little bit of what he deserves. Just a good old fashioned ass whipping. And so when I do it, when I actually take that lousy, stinking hyena, Stone Cold Steve Austin, and beat him to a bloody pulp, you somehow find it in your hearts to abandon me and cheer for him. The poison is spewing you know, from Bret Hart. I've proven myself so many times here in the World Wrestling Federation. And I've tried to be everything that you wanted me to be. But it seems to me that you don't understand. You don't understand what it means to have dignity, to have poise to bring prestige to the World Wrestling Federation, to be a man that has a, that brings a little class. Because you'd rather cheer for heroes like Charles Manson and, and, and O.J. Simpson. And... Nobody glorifies criminal conduct like the Americans do. In all the countries that I go to around the world, they still respect what's right and what's wrong. Respect. Now that we've made everything really clear with ourselves here tonight, it's obvious to me that all you American wrestling fans coast to coast, you don't respect me. Well, the fact is, I don't respect you. <laughs> you don't deserve it. So from here on in, the American wrestling fans, coast to coast, can kiss my... John Michaels, ladies and gentlemen, who joined us last night. Let's get one thing perfectly straight. You can come out here and say whatever you want about me. Everyone does. And you don't have to explain to me or the World Wrestling Federation that you would never give up the WWF title because no one knows better than me or the WWF, that it takes a handwritten note from the Lord Almighty to get that belt from you. Shawn Michaels is injured. But Brett, what you don't understand is just because I come out here and choose to live my life openly and freely instead of putting on a facade like you, does not make you a better man, Brett. I am well aware of my faults. I can admit them up and down the line. And as far as Steve Austin is concerned, Brett, I was there last night. He didn't give up. All right? Now, I'm no fan of Steve Austin's but he passed out, and even you have to admit, somewhere in there, there's got to be some of the old hitman left. Even you've got to admit that he is one tough SOB. Now, Brett, I have tried and tried and tried to take the high road. 
Now I'm in, I am in no shape to wrestle, and I know, I know, you're tougher than me, blah, 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 the whole thing. I admit that, that's fine. I don't have to be number one, Brett. I don't obsess like you do. I do this because I like it. You do it because in your mind, Mark Man, you really think all of this is yours. Now what you need to understand is that every time they reach into their pocket and pay money to watch you, me, or anybody else, they have the right to cheer or boo anybody they want. Now, hey, hey, you don't have to tell me, they're cheering me now, but they boo they booed me before, but you didn't see me get all bent out of shape about it. You want to know why, Brett? You are a liar. It's because in this country, we have something that's called the First Amendment. And that, and that amendment allows us to live our lives the way we see fit, as long as it is causing harm to no one. If that guy there wants to stick a belly button piercing through his navel, he can do it whether you like it or not. It's called freedom of expression. If that girl over there chooses to go out with someone that you don't approve of, tough titty said to kitty, and she's gonna do it. Now, I don't wanna get on my high and mighty roller coaster here, Brett, but you, my friend, have gotta look at this. I'm in no shape to go, but if you wanna go, what the hell, let's go now. Oh, don't tell me. Brett Hart and Shawn Michaels. Michaels is in no condition. He is in no condition well, what's to wrestle tonight in? because he's got more guts you and know brains. Something? Right. We've got a saying in the United States of America, and it's called America, love it or leave it. Shawn Michaels, boy toy. I think you should go back to the dress room. And just get the hell out of my face. Uh-oh. You know me, Brett. I'm not real good with authority. By the way, how'd you know I was in that girly magazine? You couldn't help. You couldn't help yourself, could you? You had to flip through the pages just a little bit. Look out, wait a minute, Sean Michaels, no! Great on going for Michael's knee! Great on going for Sean Michael's knee! He's dragging it to the post! No! He's dragging it to the post now! Thank <laughs> you. 